Hard to believe in the 2019 tax season. Hey, it's here. And there it goes. Uh, already many of you have received your W-2s. It is in your financial interest, of course, to file soon, especially if you do expect a refund on a serious note. Yeah. But as you start to file those forms, don't let haste make waste. WATE 6 on your side, consumer reporter Don Dare goes over a list of some common mistakes to make sure your tax return is error-free. Have a question. Would you pay a couple hundred dollars for something you can get for free? Millions of Americans take advantage of free tax preparation every year. Companies such as TurboTax, H&R Block, and Tax Act offer free tax software. Also, depending on your income, you may qualify for any number of free services, such as volunteer income tax assistance sponsored by the IRS. There's tax counseling for the elderly, also sponsored by the IRS, and free file. If your income is less than $66,000, you can use the IRS website to find an online software program to prepare and file your individual income tax return for free. On its list of common tax mistakes, the IRS puts incorrect and missing Social Security numbers at the top. Long gone are the days in which you could claim dependents without Social Security number. Today, every member of your household listed on your return needs to have such a number. Make sure to double check all the numbers before submitting your return. This may sound strange, but misspelling one's name is another common mistake. Sure, you know what your name is, but maybe you're typing too quickly and hit a wrong key. Or you might be interrupted while filling out the form and start up again later at the wrong spot. There are many ways in which people can and do misspell their own names, which can lead to rejected returns and delayed refunds. If you were recently married or divorced and haven't registered a name change with the Social Security Administration, make sure the name on your forms matches the name listed in Social Security records. Now, math errors, once a very common mistake, becomes less of one if you use software to prepare and file your taxes. The computer will do all the calculations, which virtually guarantees you'll get it right. However, the computer cannot know whether the numbers you've entered are correct. So double check everything to be sure your return is accurate. And don't forget your John Hancock at the bottom of the form. Many people neglect signing their name. There are two places this mistake can trip you up. The first is by failing to sign a paper return before mailing it in. The second is failing to sign your check if you're sending in a payment. Either one can result in lengthy delays in processing your return. Good luck. Don Dare, WATE, six on your side. All right, thank you, Don. If you have a consumer question for Don, send him an email at ddare, wat.com, or call a six on your side hotline number at 865-633-5974.